groundbreaking was in 2019, I believe, and uh, it's uh, you know, it's been a been a long process, it seems, but at the same time, it's it's you know we're excited about what we're seeing now and the progress that's been made in this a few short months of getting it that complete. We've Judge Rambo will tell you that she's been at this project for over 20 years. Uh, that there's this, the security concerns at the uh, at, at the Reagan Courthouse. Um, where we talked a little bit today where um, prisoners and public and judges all ride the same elevators. Uh, that the building is entrances and the building itself is right on the sidewalk. There's really no barriers. So it's a, extremely uh, important for safety issues for us to, to do that. And, and secondarily, the courtroom technology and a lot of the the issues that come along with that. This building provides those abilities to keep up with the technological type of presentations that are done in court as well. The new courthouse is a really important civic, new civic monument and building here in Harrisburg. So part of our process was to really um, do a lot of research and familiarize ourselves with the city. And it's been many years that we've been working on the project. So. Um, I think we've grown to love, love the city and be inspired by it um, from the Capitol complex to arriving in the train station and to the market to really understanding um, the place and context in which this building is emerging. And so I think in a simple way, um, the overall shape and massing of the building is really about an intersection of the community and the federal judiciary. There, there are a couple of um, things I think that um, are a very important overlay to the design, and one is about the um, uh, views and daylight in the building. And we really worked very hard to um, craft an experience that um, gave you tremendous views. Harrisburg's beautiful, the Susquehanna River is amazing, so as you move up and into the building from all the court's floors, you get tremendous views of the Susquehanna and north to the Water Gap, and um, which I think is unique, you know, and bringing all the light, and not only into the public spaces, but all the offices throughout, et cetera. So views in daylight, I think, really permeate the entire design of the building.